let's go to one that's using the orders in web apps. So this is great. Uh, and I'll, I'll do this from scratch. If you go to royalplayhouston.com, beautiful website here. Order online now. This is where your, your menu really kicks in. Once someone clicks on that order online now, the menu is already within royalplayhouston.com. It's embedded in there. Great thing is if they update their menu, it gets updated across the platforms. And of course, let's just view details, special instructions. Let's just make that mild. I don't know if that's something you can do for Tartar, but. And then after that, we'll just pick it up and boom, ready to go. Send in your email. They, you know, at the checkout process, pretty normal what you'd expect. Um, send all your information in, enter in your credit card information, all that good stuff. Um, I'll just run through this one and pretty much place order. Um, again, this one is cash only, so that's cash only, but if it's credit card, then you got to You got to enter your credit card information in there as well. And I'll show you an example of that. After that restaurant receives about five different orders uh, or rather five confirmations, five different ways, email, order dashboard, uh, fax, SMS notification, even a phone call notification. Uh, an HP e-print so they can get it printed out as well. So there's no way they're going to miss an order once that comes through. So the system is definitely tried and true. I mean, it's been used for years, thousands of orders being processed. Um, so it's really a great thing to have uh, for restaurants. So let me go into another one. Let's go into Best Euro. Uh, just want to mention that the, the site that I'm about to go to is a live site, um, meaning it is, it is owned by a franchisee, meaning a restaurant. It is a restaurant site, so please don't make any test orders or anything like that. You're free to look at it, but unless you're in the Illinois area, look, don't make any orders on this. Again, it is a live site. Let's go to the Mayfield location. So this is Best Euros, and again, you'll see a similar menu here as well with all the stuff they have. View details. Oop, this one has a zip code check. Make sure I'm in the area, and I am. So let's get a corned beef. I want mustard, extra Swiss, add the shopping cart. And so they don't have delivery available here. No problem. Um, I'll pick it up. And of course, you can set in all your information again. I'll just show you that real quick because the last time didn't have a credit card. Yep, we'll pay by credit card. And then you got a chance to do a tip too. Yeah, I'm not going to do a tip until I get there. Okay, and then they'll enter in their credit card, obviously here, and then their their CVD, which are the three numbers, expiration, and that'll complete the order. Once that order goes through, again, the restaurant will get it, um, and then everything comes along uh, as far as the food getting made, and then the person will go pick it up. So very simple. This one has multiple locations, obviously, so this is a little bit different, but you know, obviously, you can sign up businesses like this that have multiple locations, kind of like hitting three birds with one shot, uh, which is what this franchise you did. So you, this is how you can you can sell your services. You don't have to worry about building your own website. We built it for you. It's intuitive. It's beautiful. It just works. It has all the information you need on there. It's customizable. Um, so as you can see, all the different things that you you can do with these menus uh, for the business owner to look at. You can see that here. Custom ordering app, the web app, website ordering as well, tablet ordering, Facebook ordering. I'll show you Facebook ordering now as well. And the cool thing about this is, uh, well, the one cool thing is you get your own, you can set your own pricing here and all the stuff that's included, and you get a demo page. This is really awesome. Um, so again, web apps you can do restaurant. There's a retail also, so click that. Obviously, you can see this is some women's clothing stuff, uh, or. Let's hit the restaurant tab. We've got the demos for the restaurants. Mobile ordering app. Let's pull up the mobile ordering app. This is for Bucks Pizza. <clears throat> As you can see, sausage classic, pepperoni classic, all the different types of pizzas that they have. Let's view the details. Obviously the picture, America's favorite pizza. And then all the toppings you can add. And then you can add item and order from your mobile phone as well. And of course we've got the menu right there as well, just like a web app should have. Deals, we got promotions. If they're running any promotions, you can do that as well. Hey, enjoy 20% off your order. Type code 1234 when checking out. And different locations that they have. Let's go back to the demo page. Of course, the desktop, <clears throat> the tablet ordering, again, very similar. 
And then let's go to the Facebook ordering. This is definitely the, the icing on the cake for web apps. So again, we're on Facebook. I want to mention, here it is. This is the Facebook page. This is their Facebook page. Online ordering button right there. Let's click on that, online ordering. Okay, get that out of there. Okay, so we've got the online ordering. Again, we're still in Facebook. So even if they don't have a website, all they, uh, all they have is a Facebook page. Guess what? Their menu is directly in here. So folks can, they can, they can even promote their page via Facebook and advertise. So now they're online advertising on the world's largest social network. And they've got their menu right here. So folks can look at the menu and be like, hey, this looks good and order directly from here as well. So this is a really, really awesome uh, complimentary thing to have in, in, with the local search. So the fact that they're on a local search that you're driving traffic to and the fact that they have their own menu for their website, for their Facebook page, for their own customers to order through, this is really the entire package, an online ordering package to be offering to local businesses, pretty much their dream. Okay, so um, let us let me show you the back end here. Um, we can sign in directly from your, let's go in. Let's log into the admin panel back end where all the magic happens. Okay, so we're in here to the admin panel. This is where your magic happens. Pretty much all your businesses will be listed here. You've got all your different businesses here. And you can log into, let's log into the business. Let's go ahead and log into uh, what well, we were just looking at. Falafel and grill. Let me see where that's at. Ah, there it is. Let's log into their business panel. So th this is their business panel and you have access to all their business panel. You can give them their own login and password to have access to their menus and all that as well. So we've got all this different type of stuff here. Um, let's look at their menu. This is where they can customize their menu. Very intuitive to use. They want to add an item. They just add the stuff in here. Go ahead and save that. Uh, the item whoop, doesn't want me to. I'm not going to mess with their menu, but let's go back. Let me delete that. So anyways, uh, item one is in here, 99 cents, active. Of course, they can update pictures and things like that here as well. And if things are active or deactive, they can do that as well. If they run out of stuff, they can update that from here. Um, again, very simple to use, very easy for them to organize. Let me make sure I didn't add anything I wasn't supposed to on their menu. Again, this is this is a live site, so we don't want to we don't want to play around too much with their stuff here, but um, again, menu very easy for you to do or for them to do as well. Uh, let's go into their, um, let's go back to home, <clears throat> their configuration. So their, their pictures, uh, all their, their logo and all that stuff they can do from here. Uh, if they have Twitter, Facebook, all that other stuff they can, they can link as well. Currency, languages. We've got that as well, customizing their website and layout. And of course, if they need to edit anything, they can add you know, multiple locations. They can do that as well here. And we've got QR codes for them, uh, different buttons they can use as well for their page. We've got an orders dashboard here. Um, Oh, actually, they do have orders coming in. Looks like okay. So these are the orders that that have that have come in. Um, so as you can see, they've got a lot of orders coming in. They haven't cleared many of their orders, but they can clear orders as they come in. This is a great way to have an iPad set up. The restaurant wants to use an iPad. This is a great electronic way to have the orders come in. To have uh, to have an electronic way, not have a paper way of doing it. Um, and all the orders, you know, you can see the different information about what they ordered, any notes, the amount, uh, what tax, delivery fee, all that stuff's included here. Again, so just having a, an iPad or a laptop up in the back area, great way to watch the orders come in. Great free way as well. And you can hear probably every now and then you'll hear an annoying sound come up. So that lets them know there's a sound off to let them know an order's been, uh, that an order has come in. And as I mentioned, reservations, open table, they can do their custom reservations as well. 
they don't have any deals, but if you want to, any promotional codes, 20% off of your, your meal, uh, half off, you can set that all up here as well. Promotions and deals, uh, custom codes, special offers, whenever the deal expires, set all that here. Uh, and then custom pages, um, if they want to add you know, separate pages to other businesses, things like that. There's an HTML editor here as well. Um, as you can see, HTML editor. Enter in that whatever they need to enter in for their heart's delight. Link to external web pages, they can do that as well from here. Okay. For their mobile slideshow, as you can see, this is what they all they've included. Their payment integration, so they can get this, this connects directly to their bank account. They've chosen to use Stripe here. They want to use PayPal, they can use PayPal, SoluPay, we've got that as well. Um, just anywhere, basically the way their credit card transactions happen, they can set that up here. We are integrated with Stripe credit card processing and PayPal Pro credit card processing. So all credit card transactions happen that, and this is the same exact thing if somebody had walked into their restaurant, swiped their card, the same transaction fees, and that money is directly deposited to the same exact business account. So it's absolutely the exact same uh, process as they're currently using in store. And they're reporting here, as you can see, different things they can report. Um, everything from the what's what's popular to the food uh, to to down to what's uh, what customers ordered what. They can export those results via Excel spreadsheet, um, and of course they can filter by dates here. So everything is very transparent. You can go in and see exactly the orders that have been made. There's never any issue about well we didn't have that many orders this month or it's all transparent and of course you can calculate everything in your invoicing area it's all automated okay and uh, of course they got their account information and the help area as well let's go back to your admin panel so that's that was the business panel very easy to use for them again you can give them a login and password they can manage it themselves um, so You've got your, your marketing site here, and you, everything that you saw on the marketing site, customizable, SEO if you want to add keywords for your local area, Google Analytics code uh, as well, language currency, all that information is here. You can set your pricing here. Custom pages as well for you if you want to add custom pages. Again, HTML editor there for you. Um, and if they want to use fax, uh, they can, these are, these are just extra ways for you to earn revenue. One fax equals to one credit. Uh, you can, you can give them credits here. Um, distribute the credits amongst here. And they can use that accordingly. And then as well, they can accept text notifications. They can accept uh, call, phone call notifications as well. If they want to get a, a phone call notification, they can just receive email. They can receive emails for free as well. They can receive uh, emails to their HPE print, have print, uh, have print, their prints come out automatically with the order on there. But these are just extra ways uh, that you can you can um, you know generate extra revenue for yourself as well, giving them the different credits. But regardless, they can receive via email, via orders dashboard, via the fax, via uh, SMS notifications, via the phone call notification, multiple different ways for receiving orders. And of course, you can do your payment integration, which is how you get paid. Uh, this is the invoicing area, so you can have uh, direct deposited to your Stripe or PayPal. All the funds go directly to you. Um, and then all your businesses. So let's show you how we'd invoice, since we're talking about falafel and grill. Let's go ahead and go there. Okay, so um, let's bill them for a month. Change settings. So this has the whole month there. Uh, you can obviously you can put the monthly fee, the transaction fee, the setup fee, all that different type of stuff. And then you can create an invoice for them accordingly to that. Create the invoice. You have a send. You can edit, update the send template here. There's going to be a pay now link for them. They just click that pay now link, enter in their credit card information, and boom, that money goes directly to your uh, bank account. So it's a very simple, very automatic, electronic way of accepting payments. Very simple to use. And we got the resources area too for you, everything from flyers. Uh, we've got a merchant contract for you, table tent samples that are editable and Photoshop, 
And of course, we got videos, sales training videos, things like that to get you started also. And of course, news. Every now and then, whenever we're updating stuff, we'll let you know uh, how to embed menus directly in merchant sites. We've got we got periodic training that goes on as well, sales, sales training best practices, uh, webinars, things like that. Okay, so uh, the local search panel is pretty much exactly the same as this, so I'm not going to really go into that. Uh, again, they can set everything from delivery zones, uh, tip calculations, all that kind of stuff from their back end. So let's go back to the presentation and continue on.